Hi guys, Chris here. Um, slightly unusual location, uh, excuse me, for a video blog, in that I am in the sea off Budley Shelterton where Chloe and I are staying for a few days. And if I just spin around, you can see over there is the beach. And I'm just getting in some uh, swimming training before my Ironman at the end of August. And what I wanted to talk to, the, talk to you today about excuse me, with, hopefully without swallowing too much water, is about actually checking where you're going. As a lot of you will know, who know me, when I always talk about goals and the importance of knowing where you're going, but it's also important is once you know where you're going, once you're on that journey, to check where you're going. And I figured as I was swimming along, that actually I'm in the best location to illustrate this, because what I'm doing, you might be able to see in the background, I don't know if you can or not, um, there's a number of yellow marker boys that I'm basically swimming along to make sure that I'm going in the right direction. Because if I get my direction wrong out here, I'm in a whole lot of trouble very, very quickly. And that's a great analogy for businesses because once you're on your path, lots of things can knock you off your path. And it's important to stick your head up once in a while and when you're swimming, it's called sighting, so you pick the next thing that you're aiming for and keep looking up. Because if you just carried on swimming, there's a strong possibility you'd get it very wrong. And you could either swim far too far out or miss your point where you're coming back in onto the beach and end up in the next cove along or even in a much worse position. So hopefully that's a good analogy and we'll bring home to you that once you've nailed your goals down, you need to keep checking you're going the right way. And when you're not, it's not the end of the world. You just need to redirect and head towards your goal again.